Hello everybody, it's Zach here from realestatelicensewizard.com. Today we're going over another one of our practice real estate exam questions. If you're new here, you post a new question every Monday through Friday. If you have any questions you want me to cover, please comment a question down below or send us an email with a question. Of course, if you want to try these exam questions out yourself, as well as tons of others, go ahead and check out our website, realestatelicensewizard.com. Now this series is amazing for anyone preparing for the real estate exam. So I highly encourage you guys to click that like button and subscribe, that way you're fully prepared come exam day. Anyways, let's jump right into it. So today we're talking about transfer of title. So let's take a look at this question. The question says, by which of the following can you not lose title to your property involuntarily? And there's four options, A, B, C, and D. So A is adverse possession, B is foreclosure, C is dedication, and then we have D, avulsion. So as always, I'm gonna give you guys an opportunity here to pause and come up with your answer. So go ahead and do that right now. All right, so hopefully you guys came up with your answer on this one. Uh, it's kind of a trick question, so let's see what you guys got. So the correct answer for this one is C, it's dedication. That's right, dedication. So what is dedication? Well, dedication in property law means the donation of your land. That's right, the donation, you're donating. Dedication would be considered voluntary, while the others would all be considered involuntary. So obviously, when we're talking about transfer of title, you can break them down into two categories, voluntary and in involuntary, a little bit of tongue twister there. <laughs> um, but basically, that's how they break these things down when we're talking about transfer of title. When we're talking about involuntary, uh, you have examples of adverse possession, foreclosure, uh, avulsion is technically involuntary. Uh, the owner's not sitting there being like, oh, please, you know, I, I want this to happen. All these things are involuntary except for dedication. And again, if you didn't know what dedication means, uh, you're not going to get this one because this means donation of your land. So this is when we're talking about these vocab terms and these definitions. This is a perfect example of why it's important, because on paper, it's a pretty short question. But when you start to break it down, it can get a little bit confusing uh, if you don't know these terms and definitions. Again, if you didn't know what transfer of title is and you didn't know what's involuntary uh, and voluntary, you would have no idea about these questions. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be pretty much it for this one. If you guys have any comments or questions, please leave them down below. Uh, if you have any feedback, drop that down below as well. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and hopefully you guys learned something. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. As always, this is Zach from realestatelicensewizard.com. Make today magical. All right, guys. I'll see you next time.